YouTubers, welcome again to Tech World Vlogs on Tesla. I've got an exciting new uh, Tesla accessory that was sent to me from Hancho. Hancho makes great products. And if you guys are interested in this product here, I have a link in the description below. You can get 25% off by using my pr uh, promo code uh, if you're interested in this product. And what I like about this product, I'll talk about it uh, as I review this product here. Uh, it gives you a second LCD display in your Tesla Model Y and Model 3. And this display allows you to have the heads up display as you're driving, uh, which is pretty fantastic because uh, currently as it, as it stands, Tesla Model Y has a center console in the middle where all the info, infotainment as well as all the instrument display um, is on that giant iPad 12 inch whatever the case whatever the screen size is everything is towards the right of the driver and as you're driving sometimes you want to have information right in front of you such as the um, battery percentage of your car or what speed you're going at you don't want to glance over in the middle to find that information out or you may want to see um, the temperature of your battery or you might want to have information on um, what is streaming currently on your uh, media. The interesting thing is Hansha came up with a fantastic second display that you can add to get the, all that information. So with, let me show you folks what this looks like. So this is brand new, just released 2022 and I guarantee this here, everyone's going to love this here. So it's a very minimalist design blends right into the interior for the Tesla Model Y and Model 3. And this display allows you to control um, voice control. It has the music or media control, the navigation control and car information, such as the car tire pressure, um, the autopilot centering feature, um, lane assistance, basically tells you the temperature of your battery, the distance that you have uh, on a full charge or whatever charge you have. Lots of information on this LCD screen. Um, this connects directly into Tesla um, media cable. Um, I'm going to go ahead and install this. This video did take a long time for me to set up. Uh, so please, folks, if you haven't done so already, I really appreciate um, your subscription. Subscribe to the channel. It helps the channel grow. And I will have a few of these here to hand out. If you subscribe to this channel, you're interested, you love CarPlay, um, and you want to have CarPlay in your car, what Tesla currently doesn't have, this accessory will enable those CarPlay features, wireless and Bluetooth to your phone, um, and it mirrors everything that's on your phone on this device, as well as if you're just looking for a second display, heads up display to tell you all the uh, details about your car, this would be the fantastic new accessory. This just got released 2022. It's a nine inch display from Hand Show. And again, like I said before, the, in this description of this video, there's a coupon code here to get 25% off if you're interested in buying this here. Now, installation is um, is a little bit more involved, but if you like to mess around with your car, you like to get um, customize your car and do different modification your car, uh, this is the product for you. So let's go ahead and unbox this uh, and then I'll walk you through the installation. It took me a couple tries. I uh, gotta give a big shout out to a YouTuber right here. Um, check out his channel. He has a very detailed guide of how to install the vid, um, this device. Um, but I reach out to him a couple times to get some tips. I watch his video a couple times uh, and he kind of guides you how to install this device. Um, the instructions, I think Hansho can do a little better on the instructions. Uh, but they provide everything you need to get this up and running. So again, this is the nine inch instrument display for Tesla Model 3 and Model Y. So let's see what's inside the box. Uh, it does have a beautiful like packaging, which I love. It has the sexy right there and Tesla logo right there. Um, but let's see what's inside the box here. So opening this up, uh, we have here a nice magnetic case and this basically just pops open like this here and i want to show you folks how great of a job hansha did so this is why i said hansha provides everything you need uh for setup or installation uh so really well packaged product here but 
let me show you folks so there's the um the guidebook basically gives you all the details on how to install this here um also has like photos on how to install which is pretty fantastic i like that about it um but like i said i'm more of a hands-on so sometimes i get stuck i need to see um more details on how to install so i wish this book was a little bit bigger uh, but overall very easy and uh, this is the product right here folks a really beautiful display this is the design of it and these are actually the connections so basically a red and a blue connection and the design is pretty simple this actually goes into the vent um right up in front and it does have speakers and venting out here for heat and that's the display screen right there pretty awesome and overall like i said before handship provides everything you need and these are the actual power connection this connects to the tesla um media input and basically splits that video feed and this connects to the hansha um basically the hansha screen so basically just plugs in here and the red just plugs in here so it's easy pairing uh long cable because you'll need this distance and also included in the box is this really awesome bracket here uh this stabilizes it so this actually keeps this device anchored and helps it to stay still and straight and there's an extra cable here i'm not sure what this cable is we'll figure out later on but there's an extra cable here for setup which is pretty cool so that is it that is everything you need for this installation folks uh so let's go ahead and start installing this and see what this looks like So after a full, uh, almost two hours of setting this up, uh, it's finally over. And there's a couple things I want to point out here. I do love the response time of the screen. The screen has a refresh rate, I believe, of 60 hertz, which is a pretty fast response time. Um, I love the pairing with your phone. I'm not a big uh, CarPlay user, uh, so I don't really use Android for my car or I don't have an Android phone. But anyone that does have an Android phone will absolutely love this display. It pairs directly with the Android phone and you can use uh, the wireless CarPlay feature, which is just amazing. I think those folks will love it. Um, I also like all the display on the screen here. The only thing I would find that I find wasn't really accurate is the tire pressure. Uh, it's not in the tire pressure that we are associated on our Tesla. We have the bar and PSI. The, uh, the reading on the screen is not as accurate as uh, 4.9, which is not really what we are used to. Um, the temperature, I'm not really sure how it's getting that data to tell you the temperature of the actual car or battery. Um, I wish there was a little bit more control for the climate control uh, for the car. It doesn't have that on that little screen. That would be sort of an improvement. I hope it will actually be improved in the future because, uh, like I said, this is a brand new product that just got released from Hansha. So there's definitely more firmware up upgrades that's gonna come in the future. Overall, really nice panel, uh, very simple, easy 
semi easy to install does require a little bit more hands-on with your car and and if you're comfortable with it go ahead if not uh you can just get someone else to install it that have done it before uh great product great price and and everyone that's looking for an extra screen uh, i can see benefit from this here uh also love uh that the fact that uh, this is something i discover so tesla does have its own navigation system but using this screen here you can use third-party navigation such as Waze navigation or you can use uh, navigation from google maps whatever company you use for navigation you can have that take over this display so you can have that navigation shared from your phone to this display which is pretty awesome um i wish uh, i know with uh, feature from upgrade you'll have the feature to change uh things like uh your wallpaper on this device uh which is pretty cool that you can customize wallpaper options um the other thing i think could be improved on this display is i wish there was a feature added there to control um like lock and unlock the car it's not there uh, but that would be a nice feature to add on the screen i'm sure it'll come but uh, just making it more accessible um that way you can just use that screen instead of uh, looking over to the uh tesla display screen so overall the instrument display does its job it's fantastic it's a great to have the secondary display um i have experienced this before i'm not sure if anyone has but sometimes when tesla is rebooting a car sometimes the power goes out on the screen um, and i haven't experienced yet but it'll be nice to have a secondary screen in case your main screen is out of power or goes blank uh, that secondary screen will be helpful for your uh, speed or distance or your navigation um, <clears throat> overall great great uh, product thank you again from hansha to sending me this product for review again i will be giving away uh, two of these product here so please subscribe to this channel i have extra ones of these product here that i will be sharing out um, to any new subscribers so subscribe to this channel leave a comment below let me know um, if you are an Android user that would use this product and I will see like someone ship it out on my behalf I'll pay for the shipping and ship it out to you so overall thank you for watching the video I appreciate all of you please subscribe to the channel leave a like um, leave a comment stay safe and we'll see you on the next video